welcome back to my channel. I know this background is a little bit of mishmush, but it's what I've got to work with here in the house. Um, I am now officially a Houstonian, so it's really exciting. So I think it would be kind of cool to kind of give you a life update and kind of what I'm going through right now as I transition to Houston after living in Corpus Christi um, by myself the last year and a half. So for those of you who may not be aware, um, my husband and I have lived apart the last year and a half in order for me to finish my master's degree. I just graduated um, this past weekend from Texas A&M Corpus Christi with a master's of science in kinesiology. So I finished my degree and now I moved to Houston. So now it's a little bit of what now? What do I do now? So I went from having structure, a scarcity of time, things that I was required to do, all the time to having no structure, abundance of time, and no requirements of my time or things for me to do besides my own monk desires of keeping the house clean and me being able to find everything. So that's kind of where I'm at. So I can I can probably think for some people it's like, how is that a problem to go from having all that to having all of those quit it, quit, quit, sorry. Puppies are cleaning and putting their coats back together. How can that be a problem? Well, here's the thing is when you go from that part of having all your time allocated to having nothing allocated, there is a transition process to learning how you want to spend your time and what you want to do with that time and how it can be constructive with you. And it's going to take a little while to figure out what kind of process that works for you in this type of thing. I mean, I really want to dedicate my time to entrepreneurship, but that also means I have to figure out how to, I want to schedule my day and how I, what I want to accomplish every day and what kind of schedule that is entailed in that. So that's the biggest thing that I'm going for. So the big thing that I'm going to focus on the next several weeks to kind of help myself is one, I'm going to keep my morning and evening routines that I've pre previously been doing just to help provide myself some foundation and some structure. The only thing that I'll change to those is now I incorporate the dogs into that structure. Um, so that way they get their morning walk and evening walk and they get all their needs met. Number two, wow, why am I out of breath? It should not be out of breath to have this conversation. Anyway, number two, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do a um, kind of an inventory on what I want to accomplish in 2018 and for the rest of this 2017 year because I don't feel like just because we have a couple more days of the year that those are should be to waste heck no that's time I can get some stuff done and get accomplished but I think the biggest thing that I'm, I'm trying to figure out is what I want to do with that time and how can I dedicate myself you know so that's kind of my biggest thing number three I have got to find a means to get out of this house so I don't lose my mind. So right now I am looking for um, part-time, maybe even full-time gigs in coaching or maybe even a little bit of retail depending on the situation or um, an office setting just to kind of get myself out of the house right now so that way I have a little bit of structure to my schedule and also I am bringing in a little bit of money as I kind of figure out what I want to do but I also still have some time to build the things that I want to accomplish. Number four, I want to continue to provide the best content for you guys that I possibly can through YouTube, Instagram. Um, I'm also starting to do an email list. If you have not joined my email list, um, you can do that on my website, which is always linked below. I'm also going to be creating more free content for you guys that you can like take and download. So like I have two PDFs down in the description below for you that you can download. One's a macro PDF and one is 10 simple tips on how to start your healthy life today. So you can check those out in the description. So I really just want to be of service to people and I want to be able to create a bigger impact. And the last but not least, I really want to start coaching more people and be of more service. I really enjoy that setting in my career. I really want to continue to do that. Really? I'm talking. Thank you. So... I really want to be of service to people and I want to continue to coach people and be of service to people in that. The dog mom struggles, especially when your dog is the same size as you. He's ginormous, aren't you, Boo Boo? For those of you who aren't aware, 
Rex is 135 pounds. He's a small horse and I love him. Rexy, dude, just a few more minutes. Mama's talking. Thank you, you can come drool on me, that's fine. So I wanna be able to serve people in a coaching style. So that's the next thing I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to be opening up my applications to take more one-on-one -on -one clients and just be able to do that and be able to provide free content for you guys. So those are my big priorities right now. And so the big thing is providing a sense of structure and direction with my life when previously somebody else was telling me what to do with that. And I think that's gonna be some of the most exciting thing. Um, as for other life updates, we're going to be going to Oklahoma later this week. I'm going to be reorganizing the entire house because AJ's lived in here without me. So now I have to find places for all my things. And I'm also going to be consolidating a lot of our stuff and getting rid of as much stuff as humanly possible, scanning any documents that I can and getting rid of them just because we do not have the space for all the paper documents that some people acquire if we can scan it and get rid of it we are gonna have to do that because we just don't physically have the space for that so that's kind of my big goal so i hope you enjoyed this short little life update if you have further questions or you want me to do a q a on this comment those questions below and let me know what you want to do and i'll do a follow-up video and i'll also have a new background and everything for you guys so this is something a little bit more aesthetically pleasing so i'll see you guys in the next video bye